Well, that was wild. I had to defend Abernathy Farm from a few super mutants. It was a nasty fight and thankfully everyone survived. But in this foggy environment, it has come to my attention that I do need local leaders. Supply lines do need to be set up as Red Rocket here is thriving in terms of resources. We have several scavenging scavenger stations loads of beds loads of resources and my personal workshop here is just ever expanding what i do need is to make sure the other settlements are defended so with that we're actually going to head over towards uh preston here oh there's one of the merchants is that uh that's your woman yeah. trash can i wonder if she have anything i need hey carla need to pick something up road's pretty long from here let's see what kind of stuff do you have? Just a bit of everything. You'd be surprised what people leave behind on the old roads. Got got plenty to sell of your. Let's see. I've got a few minutes to browse. Always happy to. Does she have sure. anything useful? But yes, it is fantastic to see all of you. Thank you so much for joining. Um, I'm gonna take a dick doll because it's it is really good. I'm gonna take the bag of cement and fertilizer. In fact. If you have any junk, Carla, I'll probably take it off your hands if it's good junk. Uh, what? Look at this. You want how much? Right. Hear me out. Hear me out here. It's a big investment. But think I have some silly enough things I could trade for this. Namely ammo. I have more than I think I could ever really use of 38. And I have nearly 10 fusion cores that I don't need. And I'm going to pick up loads more. Ah, are fusion cores really something you want to trade though? I'll, I'll trade that one. Um, gamma, I don't really want to trade anything else. In fact, I wasn't really in abundance of anything else. I think we'll just give you like a little more of this and then that works out pretty well. Okay. Uh, how much is that worth in terms of carrying? Isn't it you just set it in the camp and you scrap it? I think that's how it works. Let's try it out. I haven't really used shipments before. Does that mean I can build loads more? Concrete walls. Yeah! I don't think it'll complete the wall. But damn, it'll do... Progress. I don't want you to snap to it. Also, I do want you to join it. Um, let me see... Everything wants to just snap, it seems. Oh, you know what I could do? I could actually... Uh, I'm giving you a little demonstration of what I normally get up to. Uh, you see, I could have it where it goes kind of the way I want it to. I could probably want it to... You know what, we could probably just keep continuing the wall as is. It's only about now that I kind of would want it to. Don't want it to slice across either. How do we go about this? I just keep building a. I mean, I suppose that could be the way. But at the amount of concrete we have, I think I will finish a majority of the perimeter. At least a good third, two thirds of it. Well, that's brilliant. Now, I still need local leader. I still need to patch things up a wee bit. But that's a good start to... Uh, once I fully wall uh, the red rocket, I'll kind of just polish and finish it off. M my goal is... I, I kind of want every settlement to just be just be nice. I can go overboard in one or two of them in my spare time if I choose to. It'll be great. But I want them all... 
pretty much as many settlers as I can get, but I don't want them to lag or anything. I want them to just be as pleasant. Nothing too ridiculous. That's the the going rate with it. Uh, Sanctuary needs a lot of work. I, I need to spend so long at this. I'm also taxi service for my uh, my family who are currently out at some bingo things. So, let's see. So, I'll tune out at some point, but that won't affect you. So, I'll just pause it. <laughs> you know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. It'll get more and more useful as we get more allied settlements. Eventually, you'll have help wherever you need it. I guess you know I'm one of the last of the Minutemen. But I never really told you what happened to us. Ooh. Are you really the last minute man? Maybe not literally. Oh, there must be a lot of Teddy. Men out Teddy, come here. Who gave it up come here. Disgust after the Quincy massacre. I'll get Teddy. But we were the last active group Enjoy. of minute men. And now, well, it's just me. We have a Teddy. <laughs> well, his first appearance for a bit. Oh, no, he's going back to the mirror. One second. He, he hits his reflection when I lifted him. He could see on the corner of this screen, like his reflection. I don't or... think we were done. Yeah. Uh, Teddy, come here. One moment. Yeah. There, he's being a good boy. Okay. What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. Where the Minutemen betrayed each other and the people they were supposed to protect. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead. So I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. Oh, he's being nice about this. Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds. But that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. Mr. Garvey is quite right, sir. Ah. Anyone can unite the See, people, hot it's thing. you. Okay, I'll do it. That's the spirit, sir, and one giant step in the right direction for the Commonwealth. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Minutemen, and the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way, General. Why are you calling me General? The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, Nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last minute man is there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. <laughs> now it's your He's got some good to humor to him, Preston. There's another settlement that needs our help. There it is! I hope you can get to them quickly. He said it. We need to show people the right. Here's where they are. I hope you can help them. We've got to show people they can count on them. Sir, a, a moment perhaps? Sure. What's on your mind? Oh, just a little something I'd like to get off the old proverbial chest. I, mm -hmm. I just want to say what an honor it is for me to accompany you. You've no idea the horror these past two centuries have wrought. The initial destruction. Not knowing if you and your family were all right. Oh, it was a relief just to find the entrance intact. I'm sorry, Codsworth. It was so sudden that... 
not even time for goodbyes. Apparently you can't say goodbye to him. But it doesn't affect anything. Family safety first, above all else. And yes, while it was hard at first, I was able to eventually move on. <laughs> at first it was the work, busying myself day and night, and believe me, there was plenty of it. But eventually the work became light chores. What truly saved me was my memories, sir. Memories of you and the missus. You make me tear up, Codsworth. Of your love and kindness. I soldiered on, fueled by hope that one day, if not you and the wife, that Sean, or perhaps Sean's children, would one day emerge. I'm glad you stuck around. Oh, sir, you don't know how good it is to hear you say that. I just wanted you to know how much I consider you family. I may be a mere robot to some, but I, I do hope you've come to see me. I consider you to be family too, Codsworth. We're in this world for the long haul. Together. Mr. Thomas, you don't know how wonderful it is for me to hear that. I feel com Well, enough blither blather from. Now, is that him at 100% affinity? Huh. No, it's not. He's almost. He's over. That must be the 750 mark. When he hits 1,000. Uh, Codsworth will be replaced. Although, I was wondering, I, I was going to give it maybe to Preston, but now that I've thought about it, I'm actually going to give it to, I'm going to get a female. So either Cat or Piper will be our next one. So let's go to £10 Bluff and get a bit more XP, because if we can get supply lines going, this settlement business is going to ramp up exponentially. Oh, there's fighting. I just arrived, and I'm already straight into it. Who is it? Probably ghouls and whatnot. Well, it's super mutants, and maybe gunners or something? Let's find out. Oh. Do you know something? I could get used to it. Yeah, hold on, hold on. I have an idea cooking. It's it's a risky one, but it might just work. They're gonna attack Codsworth, I know that. So I'm gonna bring them over to Ipo Simonja. Good job. We've got them. Come on everyone! Yoohoo! Super mutant! Codsworth. No. I need, I need them to follow. Because they can help me take out all these raiders. Yep. Come on. Just over the ridge. Don't be shy. How do they get up? There doesn't seem to be much e or an easy route for them. Seems the other ones definitely ran somewhere. This is one of the few times I hope the AI figured out. They would be of great help if I can get them up here. Outpost some more. Scared already. Yes, <laughs> yes, he's dead. Yes, we've got them all. Okay. Now. I do need a lot of AP, so I think we'll take get some damage resistance. Uh, I've nothing for AP actually. No. Should have should have brought something for that. Oh well. Ooh, he's got a fat man. Hunker down there. We've done it. We've hopefully made this infinitely easier. I'm going to get a few shots on everyone that's important. Try and kill a good few of them. 
Because obviously, you know... We want to kill all the super mutants. We want them to kill This plan might have worked. So we'll let the legendary <laughs> legendary raider take care of the rest of them. Okay, now that Codsworth is repaired and back, this, do you know what? I'm not gonna lie, I'm really impressed with myself. I think that was like the perfect way to take out the outpost because it would have been a bit of a nightmare by myself. Okay, one down. Godsworth, get him! What went from visiting the settlement to give them good news turned into... into an absolute reading fest. It does 10 cryo points. It is what it is, like, it's, it's funny. Also, on a good note, we have looted I post some more. And kill Boomer. He would have been a particularly nasty person to deal with. And I think there's a wee astonishingly Perfect. awesome tails. Do 5% extra damage at night. I know, Terry. At night. Can you believe that? Yeah, with all the family out today. Daddy is accompanying me. Let's see. I think this is now mine. Woohoo! It's all ours, Codsworth. All ours. How far away am I from supply lines? So close. With this discovered, I think I could nip back to the... Uh, Ten pines, and that would probably complete the quest, but I know there's a little turret down here. Does that do anything to a turret? It does a bit of burn, but it's not really a lot. Also, why do Molotov cocktails? You've got to be joking. Oh. Another scabber. I'm not confused if that's... I know, just in the midst of combat, I'm gonna unlock this because I would mind some explosives to deal with the rest of these. That's it. The wasteland sometimes delivers. Hide from me. Dead. Okay, that's for Ooh, I probably should save. Considering I haven't died. God's wrath! Ooh. Ooh. Need to get that Madison bobblehead at some point too. Another enemy. Like. Just up. Assuming that's like another, probably another dog. This was one of the first unmarked locations I remember doing way, way back in the first ever series, not the current one. Um, and it was the little red coat. Never fully understood why they had so many red coats, and well, they probably got them from the Museum of Freedom. Now that I look back at it. 
Uh, my commentary and, you know, assumption of places has really evolved over the, uh, over the time. Ooh, trailer. Ah, it's empty. There's a gunner camp... Uh, no, the gunner encampment's way on down. Oh, that's okay. Don't need to worry. So I think there's a wee raider up here, though, that we can definitely say hello to. He's not alive, so I suppose we can't really say hello as such. But, he's still up here, no? Ah, he's normally found here dead. Wild. It's wild that he's not here. Unless he might have despawned. Because I was in the vicinity. Oh! I don't remember seeing this either. Making waves. Right, I'm going to walk the whole way down to the end here and see if there's anything on this bus. Was the bus at the end of the highway worth it? Hey, hey, hey! It was! Those makes sense. It's kind of above outpost Zamunji. You might look down and be like, well... Sweet. See? Goes to show. You should always go that little extra mile. I think this is just the map boundary now. It is indeed. We'll just back it off from here, and fast travel over to Ten Pines. Yeah, no point in doing the walk. Let's go. Hear ye, hear ye. I'm here to tell you all that this settlement is now under my command. Did you have any luck with those raiders? I took care of those raiders for you. Really? Well, that's the best news I've heard in a long time. Let's do this. What? What happened there? Woohoo! Woohoo! This, Terry, I know, we are now going to be able to pick up local leader. Please tell me I can. Wow. That's a great feeling. So, uh, we're going to just continue on exploring. But I will be setting up supply lines using my scavengers as actually some of the first people. Uh, we will set up a supply line between Abernathy Farm, Red Rocket, Sanctuary and Red Rocket, and Ten Pines and Red Rocket. Um, and then we'll work out, we'll probably get one to Abernathy, to Sunshine, and then over to Grey Garden. I'm not going to have them all connect straight to the Red Rocket, because I... I I don't think that's how the supply lines needs to work. I actually think it would be more useful and better if I have them all connected to one another, you know, and the patrol routes will go a wee bit more, you know, to different places. I think I can make it work like that. I'm going to find out. I'll soon find out. Because if I connect this, or if I connect one to the other, and then it eventually ends up at Red Rocket, and they all get 300 concrete worth, then I know the supply lines worked. Because I've seen everyone connected them to just the Red Rocket Station or wherever their main settlement is, and I don't think you have to. I, I think it would look cool if they had all their wee supply lines connect them one another. Uh, Bedford Station's that way, so we're actually going to head in the direction of the Wildwood Cemetery. Yeah, spooky, spooky time. I don't think anyone needs my help. Where's Green Top? Green Top Nurseries in this way. I always wanted to go to Mass Fusion as well. Who are you? Lucas Miller. I've seen you before, but I can't remember what you do. Business is good. Hey. Got armor at good rates if you're in the market. I've got a few minutes to browse. Focus on stopping power. Champion's left arm, plus one strength and enchant. What? Give me that. Combat armor? Teddy, he's got combat armor. What else has he got? Oh my goodness, you are fair play. Um, look, I have a lot of money. <laughs> I don't mean to brag, but I've got a fair amount of caps around here. So, ballistic fiber. Oof, fiberglass and all. Oh, you, you are definitely... <laughs> What? So let me get this straight. The Mantis left Grieve. It's kind of like TK Mantis. 
another Fallout creator. Uh, the Mantis Left Grieve, right? It's 13,000 caps. Now, obviously, I don't have all the host of, uh, like, charisma buffs and everything to get the prices down. That is crazy. That's also crazy. 10 chance to disarm melee on attack. What? Lightweight combat armor? Okay, so we have a combat armor, right arm, right leg, and my chest. Do you know what? I would, I would basically... What did I buy off him? So champion left arm, so I don't need that. So we'll take a right arm, a right leg. Right arm, right leg. How much lighter is the light one? Oh, just slightly. Any more combat armor? No. Well, you're carrying. Uh, leather, 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 leather. Wastelander's right leg. Nah. Man, you've robbed me. You will have to take some of the stuff that I don't need. Okay, well, considering I'm going to equip these, uh, you can have my right arm. I don't need it. My right leg, because I don't need it. Teddy, you lock yourself in. One moment. He's probably away downstairs to annoy his little brother, Buster. He's a little morgy. He is a tiny dog, and Teddy is a huge dog. Right, I think I'm happy enough. We'll get rid of that. I'm going to keep the power armor. I want to store that back at base. So we have the Vance chest piece. We're going to probably take the, the power armor one. Just because it looks better at this point. So... Where's your caravan? Are you traveling alone? Like, is it just you? He's a big boy too, uh, I mean, fair play, like, damn. Lucas, I hope I can recruit you someday. That would be nice. Can't recruit him now, sadly, but. Good thing I have explosives. So this is gonna be wild. Oh, there's a raider encampment up here. Oh, there was bodies here. Or something. Now? How long? There definitely should have been a dead scavenger here. That's very strange. Right, do I do a frontal assault on the gunners here? Hmm. How do I look now? Getting there, get the army fatigues as well going, and we'll look like a we'll look like a gunner. <laughs> Come on, Codsworth, it's violence time. Uh, let's see how easy or difficult these gunners are to take down. I'm gonna up for probably not easy, so I'm gonna pull out the. Good old-fashioned 10 mil auto pistol. Oh. Fine. Raider, Raider, Raider. What are they fighting? I always work out, like... Call you in. Are you just gonna start randomly popping up? That's pretty cool. Also, didn't know there was a skeleton here. <clears throat> Nothing new to report, General. So sure about the format. Oh, Codsworth had a special line about this place. You made me miss it. Okay, 
this I think this place has a magazine. If I'm my memory serves me right, I was here at some point. So of course we will be looting that. Yes. We haul. Mm-hmm. Also seems that you dealt with uh, the normal amount of ghoul. Normally I come here, they're ghouls. Like a lot of ghouls, but thankfully not. And those Minutemen might be able to help me in a moment here. And for my first caravan, I will have to give them a fair amount of armor. Got it. Caravans don't die, so you know I'm not I'm not concerned in that regard. Lock tight. Boo. Ah, pity. Didn't think I would hit a master lock this early on, so silly me. But there's not there's nothing unique in it as far as I'm aware, so we will just uh, I will make a note of it and we will return to it when I am able. Okay, how do I get up here? Ha. Ah. Hey there. All quiet, General. It's a bit mad. I just became General yeah. and they're appearing. 5% damage against the Marlurks, you say? Do you know what? We're getting near Lake Quanapot, so that's actually a wonder find uh, for the occasion. I'm guessing these were just set up here. Right down a recorder. Huh. Can I listen to it? Oh, yeah. Godsworth. Where is Godsworth? Come here. Where is he? Hey. I'm all in. Alright, you can have all those things that I don't need. Yeah, I'll give him all my junk as well. No, not my bayonet thing. And not the flight recorder. Oh. I thought, like, it was something I could listen to. Guess not. How much better is the bayoneted one? Right, so it does 40 damage Good range, good accuracy. Harden one, more range, more damage. Ooh. Yeah, you are, you're gonna be kept. For sure. Oh no, we lost a minute, man. That is such a shame. Anyway. I think I was saying these all I might use them against the gunners here if I can That's it. Manage it. Cause I know the gunners are they should just be behind us. Can I afford really to Oh I thought I'd done this bit. No, I wasn't this far back. Whoop. There is so much to find around this. It's a good sight if you get lucky. I got lucky with uh, what appeared there. Kill the gunners, kill the gunners, kill the gunners. Yeah, we'll go up and kill them. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll do it. Okay. Uh, fry grenades. Caution, sir. I do believe something is stalking. Something stalking us? Nope. Codsworth, we are the danger here. Picking up hostile 
Oh. Uh. Ooh. Oh no. Oh, I'm bad at this. Uh, <laughs> right, right. Quick. On the. Good news is, I kind of got what I wanted. So, goodbye, vault equipment, and hello, some gunner harness. No, I don't, I don't want that. Uh, 30 army, army fatigues, that's what I want. Yeah, we're looking like a proper, proper soldier. Need to stem it up. What am I up to in stim packs? I actually think I'm starting to run out. At one stage there, it looked like stim packs were pretty much everywhere, and now it's like, oof. It's a bit rough. Oh, there's one over there. You're a bit far away and inconvenient, but I'm going to have to go over there and kill you. So. Nothing on you, of course. It's just, just business. So, my theory was this one with the sniper shot the scavenger, but the scavenger never spawned, so that was a wee unmarked location, and we built up a story around it, but had I done the 100% playthrough, I would have known that one of the gunners there has a sniper rifle. I also am armed with the fact that, uh... No, 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 I want to go up! All aboard! Well, at least Godsworth's with us. Don't get crushed. Godsworth! <laughs> that, that hurt. That must have hurt. Oh, there's no one up here. All quiet and peaceful. Love that. What? There's no one up here. Last time I came up here, there was a few. When I was doing this as an unmarked location. Huh. Well, there's a charging laser rifle. That was fair. It's a good trade. In fact, it definitely has made this whole debacle worthwhile up here. There's the General Atomics Gallery, the place where you can give oodles of money for next to nothing. Uh, or for absolutely nothing, you, you get the ability to bowl or something like that. <laughs> oh dear. These scams these days. Okay. But you couldn't have used this as a settlement. Again, in terms of settlement options just throughout Fallout, it, it never made a lot of sense to me at times. At times, because it just, you know, they're just different play styles. God. So some people would have preferred just little outposts like this with some trips. You know, some people would have preferred the settler life. You know, obviously they introduced like the raider faction later on in the DLC. You know, there was just there there wasn't an awful lot of options as to how you set up settlements. You know, instead of settlements, you could have outposts, bases, you know, different categories. Some people want to build base sprawling cities and there should have been like wee areas to do, you know, just that. I, I know there is, I'm being pedantic about it, don't get me wrong, but... 
Okay. Hold on to your butts. There's a lot of ghouls here. In fact, I often forget. Oh. Huh? Where is everyone? I wonder how many people these days are given to Hell yeah. Okay, we can now hack turrets. I can't be the only one that's come here and there's like a glowing one and about 25 ferals. That's odd. And there's normally a raider in here. What gives? I have been robbed of opportunity to fight. Oh. You're mine now, rookie! Oh. Well, that explains why the place was so well kept. No one else. Wild. I suppose that's why it's called Wildwood Cemetery. <laughs> yeah. That's that's awfully strange, not gonna lie. How much bones can I carry? I can carry a few more bones. They all respawn, so. <laughs> that skeleton's like, you're doing what? Turns out bones don't even weigh that much. Once again, a great find. What's that in the distance? I'm not seeing things. There is something. I think it's a pack ramen. <gasps> One of the rarest tier 4 traders in the game, Smiling Larry. Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, let me let me get across here. Come on. What? That looked like we hatch or something. No. <laughs> Just keep your hands where I can see them. You looking to trade? Smiling Larry's got what you want. What are you doing out here? People want something. Smiling Larry finds it, brings it to him. The whole Commonwealth knows me. Now, what about doing some trade? Sure. Let's trade. If Smiling I've, Larry hasn't got it, you probably. I have so, so much to get from these people. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I just need to rub my eyes. So you have nothing, Smiling. You're like the most legendary merchant that you can find but Lucas Miller has all these legendaries and you have eh, not much in fact less than not much you have nothing you don't even have anything what is this that's a joke yeah yeah you, you head on there what so I got no ghouls in Wildwood I got a smiling Larry with nothing on him what is this? <laughs> what sort of run is this? Ah. Brilliant all the same. So, I think we're going in the right direction. What's down here? Recover the 10 millimeter from... <laughs> it's a bit far away, like... I'll discover the Galleria. I'm not gonna... Or no, I won't discover it just yet. We'll leave it. Again, if I discover somewhere... Normally, it's because... I'm gonna just straight away do it. But I am gonna complete the mass fusion containment ship. There is the relay tower, so I... Hmm. Probably should have lipped up north round. I can just skip on the... To the shed. Didn't make too much of a difference. There's another hunter. Raider. You'll be easy to deal with here. In fact, before I Ooh. I'm gonna tell you fucking throw Ooh. Okay, so loads of Mire Lurks, loads of Raiders. Oh, 
on on the topic of take no damage, the Smiler counter is taking no damage. Oh, gotta get the parents here. BRB. Where did I leave off? Oh yeah. Ah! Smiler counter. Oh, that scabber didn't stand the chance. Um. Oh, that hurt. Huh. Right, I see what you're trying to do. Right, none of these are piercing you. Maybe a, you don't like fire. Um, and we'll try lasers on you. Oh no! Damn it! Blew myself up! Seems these ones had a bit of a party! Now, now, did you see me die earlier? Yeah, that was the thing. Well, here's here's my proposition. I'm gonna kill this Marler Hunter, because I'm I'm somewhat a bit angry about that. My lack of skill. Is he about? Oh hey! Oh no! Crap! Some goodies there, though. Did you know what? I'll just sneak over, discover the pond, take everything. This should have been an unmarked location, and I will die on this hill because this place has nothing, bar these raiders. And trust me, I can find about a million other places where this is the case, or where there's just conceivably more stuff going on. Right, so south is the Medford Memorial Hospital, which we obviously know contains danger. Uh, the Sentry Bot Shack is also nearby. Um, yes, I, I, I know I shot at it. I, I, I know. I just, I am a wee bit annoyed that... Oh, it swims. Oh, it swims really fast. Okay, what? What was my plan? Uh, right. Molotov cocktails. And laser pistol. No laser pistol. What's all this? Fire damage. Ineffective, Adam. Turns out stepping and sp going back and forth is effective. Right. Um, bit of heal, and I think I can kill him with shotgun. Well, I don't even need to use that. Eyes up, fat man. Ooh, could do it. Nah, no, take the time out. There's something on my gun. It's like a B-Tech. 
42 XP. You were not worth all the ammo I had to expend. Hello, buddy. Come on. Come on, safe. Are you certain I'm the man for the job, sir? <laughs> nah, we'll discover it. There we go. See? Discovered. Your relay tower will go there. Then, uh, we'll hit the, uh, Containment shed. I wonder what enemies we'll find up here. Hello, hello. Oh. Ah, no. <laughs> Codsworth. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm going to have to use. Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying very fast. I need something to, to deal with this. Everything. I'm going to throw the kitchen sink at this guy. There's my auto pistol. You're not flying away. You mash everything and you pull out the, the shotgun. <clears throat> Take this legendary red widow thing. What do I get for it? I, I, I mean, I guess I'll take it. Why has this place been so grim? <laughs> Clearly I need more armor, more levels, and more everything. Whew. So now that we've activated that, we'll get all the new radio signals. Woohoo! And I know where just all of them are. Uh, Lake Quanapoet we will do a later stage. I want to raid the building on top of this before heading to Mass Fusion. This has been such a wee setup. No way I'm cracking this. Uh, that's a pity, but I'm going to take all the vacuum tubes. Ooh. It's a shame, because, I mean, I don't really know what I'd do with you, but you exist, and that is a thing. <laughs> okay. No. Ain't going that way. Okay, so we can, there's a squad of four of them. Listen. That ain't our fight, Chief. <laughs> that being said, though, no, there's some rad scorpions I could lure into them, but. <laughs> Any other vicious enemy? Do you know what? I wonder how they'd fare against rad scorpions. We'll find out in a second. 
Me. I'm not gonna. Oh my goodness, you. Brilliant man? candidate. Cosworth? No. problem over here. I'm about to have a super mutant problem with my death. Your time is done. This is the urge of the Ooh, this is tough. This is tough. This is rough. Get him! Yes! I mean, it kind of did something. Oh, it's limping. I almost feel bad. What you gotta do, Deathclaw? Okay, you, you look equally as terrifying, slowly limping towards me. Have you ever seen a limping Deathclaw? I've never seen this before. Oh, I'll, I'll put you out of your misery. Cheers for that. These guys. No. Okay, I need more, I need more support. So the suicider into the death claw. I mean, that made for quite the scene. Uh, jump scare me! Ooh! Ooh! You take them. You take them. I don't want them. I don't want those rod scorpions. Oh! It's right beside me. Ow, 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 ow. I'm gonna save quick. <sighs> Leave me alone! Go attack the other ones! Why are you attacking me? <laughs> run! I'm gonna have to just run. Like it. I'm so lonesome, thanks. <laughs> okay, I, I clearly cannot get away from you. I don't know what's part of the deal here or what. I'm gonna hear them pop up again. Haha! Mm. -ha! Nothing you can do about me now. Sure not. I have a blast in your name on it. Back it off. Yes, fight each other. No! Get him, Coltsworth! Oh, he's got him. Mr. Thomas, pick anything good? Well, this was not what I had in mind. Fun, but not what I had in mind. Yeah, we'll eat the egg. Yeah. I'll take some buff fight again. So we can kind of keep running by it. Surely, surely they're near dead. Hello. You all just carry nothing worth value. <laughs> or nothing worth of any value. Okay, I'll just drop all that. So we killed death claws, rad scorpions, we got the car tree. On the day's work, I suppose. Yeah, let's go visit. Little bunker. Normally that's where Yao Guai is patrolling, but I guess I got really lucky with Lady Deathclaw. 
Got it. Woohoo! What a cool broadcast. Unfortunately for us, there isn't too much in the way of supplies here. And apparently... What?! Don't ever remember, remember finding that, so... That's a first. Is there anything else here of value? Nope. Okay, what are we dropping? What, what did I pick up that... What? The sniper rifle. Crap. They're all worth so much. Am I carrying a fat man too? Why am I carrying a fat man? Oh, I got. I think I got that off Boomer. Wasn't it? Something's got to go. Right, well. The board's first. The Ben had a tuned one. Look, it did well. It was a good, it was a good weapon whilst it lasted. Now, let's nip home, teleport back, and we'll hit the mass fusion containment shed. That'll be us. Back to another adventure for us. And now it's going towards Malden. Hi, Lon. I know we're going over the hill. Trade, boy? Why is that a gunner mercenary? Who are you? What are you doing out here? Name's Dreth. That's all you need to know. Now, you're here for business? Mm hmm You a traitor? All right, let him through. <clears throat> it's late. You gonna buy something? I've got a few minutes to browse. Take a look. I was gonna say I would be a bit weird if she just walks away, but... I'm not gonna pay that much for a stim pack. I, I, I can't pull myself to do that. Although your sub machine guns seem cool. I could pick them up for caravans. I haven't seen many of them. Take 45 ammo. I'm gonna start doing supply lines, so I'm gonna give you a solid. Damn mercenary. Okay. Wait. Oh. She can be of some use then. Uh, well. You're probably gonna need some rat X for this one. I have brought rat away though. So. Well, speaking of rat away. That's a good start. Though I probably should have equipped the rat away. Or the Rat X, should I say. Okay, knock knock. Desk fans! Yes! I get so excited! I see. Desk fans. Hmm. I'll let Dread go on there. Wonder is she like a potential companion? Or not companion, I'm being silly. Wonder is she a potential like oh. Legend Not a uh, potential trader. That's the word I was looking for. I'm just racking my brain for that. Oh, I can't open this. Oh, I can open this though. Okay, I need that rod X badly. So I'll need to be quick exploring this place. <gasps> this one. It's a novice lock. It should be handy. Cave. No. If it's not cave, then it must be. Well, it can't be late, can't be back. Can't be nail, can't be roof. Oh, it could be roof. 
Okay, Rift's got two. Okay, look. No! Try to reset. Um, what has two, like, loot? Or look. Fork has... Nothing the same as Rift, so it can't be that. Pots? Pots is nothing like look. Road! No. Oh, loan? Has one. No. There must be something I didn't see. Do you know what? I'm going to actually see if I can cancel a few of them here. No. Well, I'm all out of luck on that one, Chief. Fork? Would it be like clam? Couldn't be clam. Oh, look, only had one. Oh, I'm an idiot. Look, only had one. Okay, so pots, forks, right? What is this? Anything like pots or fork? Uh, pots, nope. Fork, nope. Uh, anything like pots? Uh, nope. Pray. Uh, it's got a P. Um, for fork, it has nothing, and for roof. It also has nothing. Road has two. There's one of pots, one is road. That's it. Okay. After 34 days of being accident free, Lester tripped behind the forklift whilst it was backing up. We're now back down to zero. Also, corporate made us put up these remember your hard hat posters like that would have saved his life. So clearly, he passed. Um, but it explains all those remember to wear your hard hat posters. The company retreat is coming up in a couple of weeks. Mr. Field said it's mandatory for all employees, especially supervisors. I hate going to those things. It's bad enough having to deal with these people during the week. Now I have to pretend I like them for a whole weekend. Sometimes I envy Lester, the one that got hit by the forklift. A hazardous material inspector stopped in today unannounced to check our operation. I started to feel like he was getting suspicious of what was actually going on here. I told Mr. Field that if he and said if the inspector started catching on we needed to get rid of him and he didn't mean and he didn't mean ask him to go away well he caught on so we had to get rid of him if anyone finds out what we did they'll put me away for life well i can tell you we know exactly what he did or what they did to him let's just say it was a grim way to go right we have to be speedy because the rad x is slowly wearing off. Which means we'll pick all these with expedience. Yes. Blue torch. Take the fusion core. Oh, the rads are starting to pick up again. We'll definitely pick up another radix in that way. I actually put most of my radix back into my supplies. Like an idiot. I'm assuming that was the inspector given just the storyline of things. And yes, they were dumping all the toxic waste just into the ground. But what you might not know was the reactor level here. For you see, this is where the distress signal's coming from. Because if you listen to it, which I should have, it talks about there being a reactor problem in the sub-level. Sweet. Well, this is the reactor in the sub-level. So, all we have to do is flick that. I'm stabilized everything. Woo! We saved the city. Desk fan. I swear it's going to be a meme by the end of the series. Yep, that's all you needed to do. Now we can exit back out. But oh boy, are we not done with this place. For you see, there is an Easter egg on the roof. That we're going to go check out. Let's get out of this irradiated hellhole. And nip over to the side here. Oh, anything in here? Nope. So, it's up there. We have to get to him. And it's easy as climbing this pipe here. To this point. Oh, no, condenser's lootable. Today I learned. Got a synth. 
Um, we've got a raider. Apparently, this is a a, a deuce, deuce ex, dx reference. That movie. I, th I think that's the correct term. So yeah, kind of cool. Blade Runner, Blade Runner re reference. I'm thinking like Deus Ex Machina or something. No, uh, Blade Runner. So apparently there's a scene similar to that and that's where it was inspired from. In terms of the actual roof, there is sadly nothing of good note. Is dearth still about? Is. Can I use them? Yeah. Well, they're going to be useful in a wee second here because this, this jump scare got me at 3am once and I'm never letting that happen again. Oh. Huh. Normally there's a rad route to jump site. I guess not. Huh. Strange how that was a thing. And now it's not. Okay, so we have clearly reached the town of Melden here. And we have this little old gullet sinkhole. Well, that's going to be a fantastic place to start off when we come back in the next episode. So it's been a brilliant evening, morning, afternoon, wherever you are with you. It has been fantastic. So let's have a wee look. We obviously liberated outpost Simonja. It's cleared. We're going to get a wee recruitment beacon going. We now have supply lines, so I'm going to be working very hard behind the scenes to get that sorted. Uh, cleared Skylands, Wildwood. Uh, we even did, well, we discovered quite a lot of places. Um, got a lot of fighting done, so in the next episode we will be doing the old gullet sinkhole, maybe popping into the Medford Memorial Hospital, or we'll head towards Green Top Nursery and see who they need dealt with. Of course, we do need to go to the Medford place. I think I have a quest for that. Yeah, we need to help the settlement by killing all the mutants in the Medford Memorial. So that's kind of two birds, one stone. That quest is going to be way down the line. It's a wee miscellaneous one, so it's not the biggest issue. Um, but yeah, we have conquered quite a bit. It's looking good. Anyways, I'll catch you all in the next one. Thank you for watching.